We had commercially launched Black Hawk for the first time this year, had tremendous results across uh, uh, the potato growing regions of the country in the Pacific Northwest, the Red River Valley, Michigan, and up through the Northeast. Uh, really excited about Black Hawk. Um, excellent control of Colorado potato beetle uh, is really the first and best attribute of the product. Uh, also, you get uh, consistent control of Colorado potato beetle with the, the unique formulation that, that Black Hawk provides. And it's a, a unique mode of action. It's a, it's a group 5 insecticide, and it's really the only group 5 insecticide uh, that targets Colorado potato beetles. So it works really well in a resistance management scheme, particularly if you're in an area where you've, you've maybe seen some resistant to uh, uh, neonicotinoids uh, and, and to Colorado potato beetle. Uh, the formulation is a lignin-based formulation of Blackhawk. So what that technically means is the lignin binds to the spinosad particle, which is the active ingredient in Blackhawk and it allows the spinosad particle to stay on the leaf surface for a longer period of time, which provides for more consistent control. Well, you definitely want to stay within a, a resistance management scheme whenever you're using Blackhawk, so you don't want to target uh, consecutive generations of Colorado potato beetle with Blackhawk, but if you stay with the same generation uh, with Blackhawk, you should be in, in good shape. We're, we're really excited with the results we've had this year with Blackhawk and, and look forward to to uh, having more adoption and more growers finding it next year. It's uh, kind of a limited introduction this year, um, but we'll have more product available next year as, as growers got a taste for it. And we, we certainly expect that, that more growers will adopt to it after uh, seeing and hearing the good results that maybe some other folks had this year.